so we just went through the circuit for A or B and not C, but now instead I'd like to show you a little bit what this might look like on the breadboard. So if we have three switches, okay, A and B and C that we were going to come to, and we have our 7404 not, our 7408 and, and our 7432 or, and these are TTL style chips, so they all have ground and power in the same place. So up here we're going to run all of these to a bus that is power. All right? VCC or VDD. Okay? And all of these would run down to ground, all right? This is where those pins lie on TTL chips, okay? And you'll notice I've drawn the um, notch on these um, ICs so you can see the orientation. So this is pin one here on all the chips, all right? And so if you look at your pinout diagram, and I was making A or B and not C, okay, the first thing I would do is I need an input from A, and A goes into what kind of gate? Well, it's not anded with anything, so it just goes into an OR gate. So I would take a wire from here and jump over, and I'm going to connect it to pin 1 of my 7432 because when I look at my pinout diagram here, pin 1 is the input to an OR gate. All right? Now I need to look at B. B goes into an AND gate, so I'm going to take a wire from there and run it into the input of an AND gate. So now B came in and it went into pin 1, oops, that's a 7411, excuse me, of the 7408, okay, which is an input, and it needs to be combined with the other input. Well, what's the other input to the AND gate? It is not C, all right? So that means that I have to take one from C, the switch and then its plugs, okay? I'm going to go around, i got to get all the way to the input of the NOT gate right there. That's the input of the NOT gate. And now I need to take that NOT, all right, and I'm going to combine it with what? Um, I take that output. This is the output of the NOT gate when you look at your pinout diagram. And it has to be ANDed in. So I jump over. So I'm going to wire it into the other input of the AND gate. So here's my AND gate. Input, input, output. Alright, so now I've made here on this pin, this one was not C, this is B and not C. So that output needs to go where? It has to go into my OR gate. Alright, so I'm going to take it to my OR gate, which is my 7432, and put it in. Now the output of the OR gate here pin 3. That's my final output and this is I'm going to normally run it to my LED indicator or buzzer or whatever the symptom was, uh, the output is. Okay, So that gives you a little idea of what this might look like on a breadboard. Hope this helps.